How to cancel a transaction and Binance. Hello guys, welcome into this new video. In today's tutorial, let's see if we can cancel a transaction in our Binance account. Now, first of all, you need to understand that speaking about transactions, speaking about the crypto world and all that, it's most likely as you might lose your tokens or your transaction just in case you were uh, mistaking or something like that. So, but let's see what we can do in Binance and let's see if we can uh, cancel our transaction. So first of all, we need to understand what kind of transaction we just made. So if you go into the market and go into the spot, when you want to make an, a specific transaction, uh, let's say you wanted to, so let's say you wanted to place an order here on the marketplace so you want to buy or trade cryptos and if you want to make some kind of a uh, transaction let's, let's get into something like that and you might see your order has been opened in here so the only thing you want to do is to select this option that says cancel all now speaking about transaction of an nft or transaction that you might see uh sending into another wallet you want to go into your overview and after you go into your overview, you want to scroll down until you see the transaction history, which is right in here. Now, let's say we have all your recent transactions in here listed. So as you can see, you can see all your uh, transaction history right in here. So just in case that maybe you, uh, you have a problem with your deposit, maybe your deposit hasn't arrived into your Binance account or the other wallet, you go ahead and click into the deposit hasn't arrived, click here. So after you click in here, you're going to see that Binance has a few options. So uh, they can be helping you with this specific situation. So so it depends on the situation that you are. You don't know the reason why your deposit hasn't arrived. Maybe you forgot uh, a memo. Maybe you deposit an unlisted coin or maybe another exchange refunded your deposit or maybe you just don't know. Speaking about other wallets and other exchanges, it's a little bit more harder to recover all our transactions because in the crypto world, it's pretty much uh, hard to recover your crypto money. So if you, by my own experience, because I've made a few mistakes, um, not in not in Binance, not in Binance only, but in MetaMask and in Phantom Wallet as well, and it didn't went really well for me. So I ended up losing like almost. $80 of crypto so you're gonna be really really careful with that guy so so I strongly recommend you guys to enter in here so uh, you can receive the exact and more detailed solution through your problem guys so there you have it don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about Binance thank you for watching the video and I'll see you guys on the next one